Good morning, hot dogs, and welcome to the morning announcements. It's finally Friday, and there'll be a three-day weekend. Antonio, are you doing anything special this weekend? No, most likely just be sleeping in. Are you doing anything special? Uh, yes, I might go to Indy. Sounds like fun. Now time for the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Ivan, guess what? What? We got lunch today. Today for lunch, we are having corn dogs and chef salads. Finally, we're getting school lunch. All right, now let's send it to Breaking News with Emily and Sports with Elijah. Thanks, Ivan. Good morning, hot dogs. It's finally Friday. It is currently 34 degrees outside with some light snowfall. There's a high of 39 today, and tonight, temperatures are going to drop to 26 with flurries. Looking ahead, snow is expecting tomorrow and Sunday as well. Enjoy your day and have a great weekend. We'll see you back here on Tuesday. Hey, I'm Elijah. The Lay Hot Dogs JV team won their fifth straight game last night over Western Boone, thanks to a Sydney Waker game-winning three-pointer at the buzzer. Waker finished with nine points. Varsity will travel to Western Boone tonight looking to complete the sweep. The boys JV team won last night 61-44. to The team put together a solid performance overall as a group. They got off to a slow start on the defensive side of the ball, but Eli Oldham's early shooting carried them through a 12-12 tie at the end of the first quarter. The Dogs outscored the Stars 20-10 in the second quarter and 29-22 in the second half. Austin Penry led the team with 15 points and did a good job on the boards inside. Chris Russell and Eli Oldham chirped in 14 each, and Kai Kirby had 13. The team will play again on Saturday night at Rossville. Last night, the hot dog swimmers had conference preliminaries. They qualified 22 swimmers for, that, for Saturday's conference swim meet. Good luck. Good luck to Emma and Erica Pillion tonight as Emma will wrestle in the 120 pound girls state bracket her first match she'll have Hanover Central while Erica who wrestles 98 pounds will wrestle Jay County the girls state meet will be at Hamilton Heights so if you see them make sure wish them good luck that's it for sports see you guys on Tuesday There will be a crash meeting on the 21st after school in Collaboration Room 1. All members are invited to attend. If you would like to be a part of Crash, this is your opportunity to be a part of it. The benefits of joining Crash are community service, opportunities, uh, networking, helping others including yourself, hands-on leadership experience, earning the Crash course for graduation, first-hand first -hand knowledge of upcoming events and opportunities such as scholarships, internships, and community events and conferences. Sounds interesting. Join Crash. Seniors, make sure to order your cap and gown. March 12th is approaching fast. That is all for the announcements today. Make sure to stay safe and stay motivated. Make sure to like, subscribe, and have a great weekend.